Hello kiddos and welcome to Home Schooling with Hera. I'm your teacher Miss Hera and today I'm here with a new sound for you. But before we learn something new, let's quickly revise some of our previous sounds. Ready? You can mute the video and say these sounds yourself and if you want to repeat after me, get us started. A O I J G A E E O A D N F M and B Well done, you did a great job. And since you remember all these sounds, it's time to learn something new. And you know that we learn the new sound with this story. So please open your big ears because you will find the sound hidden in this story. So please listen to the story carefully. An old donkey and some sheep live next to a small cornfield. Nora and Jakim like to go and talk to the donkey. The donkey is always very pleased to see them. When he sees them coming, he brays, e o e o e o and waggles his ears up and down in greeting. One August morning, the children go for a walk to see the donkey. He brays happily, e o e o e o Jakim gives the donkey a carrot. The carrot comes from my garden. Says Nora, I have carrots and sweet corn growing there. As the children talk to the donkey, big rain drops begin to fall. Behind the children is an enormous rain cloud. I think we had better get home quickly, says Jakim. There is a storm coming. We will have to run home as fast as we can. The children run off, waving to the donkey. And this is the end of our story. Now who will tell me the hidden sound in this story? Yeah, you are right. It is e o e o e o when the donkey waggles his ears up and down in greeting. Now if you want to do the action for this sound, you need to put your hands on your head and flap them up and down like the ears of a donkey, saying E o e o e o. Look at this. First, put your hands up. Say e. Then put your hands down, and say o e o e o e o. And this is our sound. Did you notice that we are saying two sounds in today's story? The first sound is. E that we write like this, and the second sound is that we write like this. So in today's video, we shall only solve the verses of E, and we'll see how to write it as well. So let's go and find out how do we need to write this sound, E. It's easy peasy lemon is squeezy. Put your index finger up in the air and start moving it with my finger. Go straight and a curve. Write a. Straight and a curve, right? A. Eh. When you write a eh twice, it becomes e. You know very well how to write a eh. sleeping line and round, sleeping line and round. To a eh make e. Repeat after me e. Right? Now we are going to solve our worksheet, and since you already know how to write it, I'll be just writing it once and you can pause the video and complete this worksheet yourself. Okay? So let's write E here. Do say the sound after writing it. E. E as in tree. E as in heel. E as in seeds. Can you see these little seeds? E. And if you want to write E in the lines, you need to use only the blue lines to write E. 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 And there you go. Please finish this page yourself and then continue to the next worksheet. 
So can you tell me what do we need to do in this worksheet? Yeah, in this worksheet, we need to circle the pictures in which we hear E sound and leave the others, right? So let's do it with me or if you want to pause the video and do it yourself, go ahead. E, tree, sun, E, tree, sun, tree, we hear E in tree, E. Pool green, pool green, e green, e clock feet, clock feet, e feet, e lamb sheep, lamp sheep, sh. Eep. We hear E in sheep. E. Igloo. Eel. This fish is an eel. This is the name of the fish. Eel. Do you hear E in igloo or eel? In eel. We have E in eel. Kudos. We did it. Now we have another worksheet and here you need to check the pictures in which you hear the E sound and cross out the others, right? Listen to the words carefully. Heel. This is a heel. Sandals with a pointed heel are called heels. Do you hear E in heel? Yes, we do. Umbrella, umbrella. Do you hear E in umbrella? No, we don't. Knee, knee. This is someone's knee. Do you hear E in knee? Yes, we do. Mirror, mirror. Do you hear E in mirror? Nope, we don't. Wheel. Wheel. Do you hear E in wheel? Yes, we do. Clock. Clock. Do you hear E in clock? No. And this is finished. Now we have to draw something here that has an E sound in it. So take your time, pause the video and draw something with the E sound in it. And after doing this, we will be doing some blending because it's blending time. And this is the most important part of our lesson. So are you ready? Try to read these words yourself or you can repeat after me too. Say the sound. B. E. B. Quickly. B. The honeybees. S. E. C. Say it quickly. C. F. E. F. Quickly. F. E. P. E. P. O. P. Say it quickly. P. S. E. C. Seen quickly. Seen. Whoa, that was great. And now it's time to do the segmenting. So take out your notebooks, hold your pencils, and let's get started. Now I'll be saying some words to you. You need to listen to them carefully. Put the sound dots for each and every word, and then try to write the sounds as well. Right? The first word is. C, C. How many sounds do you hear in C? S, E, C. We hear two sound. Now let's write the first sound. S, E. Together, C. Well done. Let's try to write the word peel, peel. What is the first sound? P. 
then e p p let's write the sounds p e o p quickly p too good now let's try to write the word b b what is the first sound b then e together b let's write the first sound now b b go down come up and round b e together b Whoa, very nice next word is teen teen let's put the sound dots t e n teen let's try to write the sounds now t e t n teen say it quickly teen yes it's right the last word is here try to write the word feel feel what is the first sound e o feel let's write it now e feel o feel quickly feel and we are done you are amazing kiddos and since you have done all these things very nicely here is a treat for you you have got a curling page if you hear the e sound in any of these pictures you need to color in the picture if you don't hear e sound leave the picture as it is okay the first picture is of a tree then we have teeth then we have skull next is candle and the last one is feet tree teeth skull candle feet please color in the pictures that have e sound in them okay and with this we are towards the end of our lesson here i'm giving you some homework you need to open up a story book and try finding some words that have an e sound in them okay try to read the sentences or even if you don't want to read just try to find out two e's written together and copy down that word in your notebook okay next we have an activity it's the thumb printing activity you need to dip your thumb in yellow or black color paste it on a piece of paper and then if you have dipped it in yellow so draw some black lines on it and then make two eyes here two antennas and the wings and your bee is ready you can make as many bees as you want and with this is the time to say goodbye to you i'll see you soon with another sound i hope you have liked the video if yes so please click the like button if haven't subscribed subscribe to the channel so you can get the notification of the next video as soon as i upload it take care bye for now and don't forget to make it a great day bye